What up, everybody, and welcome back to my channel. I am Tasha. Think of me as your big sister, and I am here helping you create the life by your design through bettering your relationships, bettering yourself, and bettering your life. Basically, I'm here for motivation and positivity. So today, what we are going to talk about is four tips, four tricks, just kind of four ways in which you will not lose yourself in your relationship. So, tip number one, make time for you. You have to do things on your own. When you're in a relationship, yeah, you know, in the beginning, we always want to do everything with that person. You have to find you. You have to know what it is that you like. And if you don't know what you like, go find out. Go, just go get up and go do something. Number two, know your role. And I don't mean know your role like, you know, there's certain things that a man does or there's certain things that a woman do. Like, that's not what I mean by know your role. Know your role as far as if you're someone who loves to give and you're constantly giving, 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 giving. Eventually, yes, you can burn yourself out by giving all the time. But you have to accept the fact that you're a giver and you love to continuously give. And guess what? partner's going to get used to that and they're going to expect you to always give. Any relationship is a two-way street. So if you know that you're a giver and you like giving, don't be mad about it. Accept it. Number three, say what you want. We're not mind readers. Nobody is a mind reader. So we don't know what you want. They don't know what you want. Speak up. Open your mouth. In order to get the things that you need, sometimes you gotta say what you want. Especially women who, you know, everything is said by our faces. Don't expect them to even read your face because some people may look at your face and just say, okay, she just looks like that all the time. So if there's something bothering you or if there's something that you want and there's something that you need, say it. Say it. Tip number four. I think it is the easiest highly underrated and a lot of people just don't do it say thank you say thank you oh, thank you Tasha for being here today we are really are really appreciate you coming on camera with your cuteness it's like no I'm just oh god like for me when my husband used to take out the trash I should never say thank you because in my mind I was just like well you should be doing that anyway why should I say thank you to you but I, I have to realize that they're doing that because they really care. Like they're not doing that out of obligation. They're not doing that because they have to. They're doing it because they love you and they really, really care about you. So don't just expect them to do things for you. If someone does something nice for you, say thank you. Even if you may feel like you should be doing this anyway, say thank you. It is so simple. Thank you. Thank you everybody for coming to my channel and I hope that this content was of value to you. If you want to see more videos like this, please hit that like button if you want to or hit that subscribe button if you want to. And remember, only you can design the you that you want to be. Thank you and I'll see you guys in my next video.